Thank you. Can we please stop bringing up Kuta Kente, the man that single-handedly destroyed the NFL, destroyed their revenue from ticket sales to merchandise and historical ratings? Play the clip. You can't hey, make this shit up. Grab, sis, and try to run with you Let's dance. start with this, Colin. Stop. Okay. Let's just stop. Okay, Colin Kaepernick's been out of football. He was a bum. For what, five years now? Yeah. I, I, yeah. Come on, come man. Come on, man. The social justice warrior stats was horrible when he did play. He led his team to 2-10 and ten when he was finally benched because he only threw four yards and three quarters against Chicago. Let's not forget he opted out of his own contract on the offseason. It was his choice. Kind of like Harry made his choice to marry Megan. He made his bed, now he has to sleep in it. He was a terrible quarterback and he knew it, so he decided to make his fortune off the woke society. That's the truth of why he kneeled in the first place. He got benched, got mad, and wanted to make a statement. Which is the same behavior of the Duke volleyball player Rachel Richardson Smollett. Her team lost, she got mad, so she made up a race hoax. Truth. 